is Shelby and welcome back to my channel and oh my gosh it has been a hot minute since I sat down and recorded a video so yeah and I kind of feel like my camera is going to fall at any moment because my like thing that I have it propped up on is really wobbly and kind of tilted so I feel like I look like like tilted oh dear god okay so I uh, I have an agenda I swear so um let's let's chat for a minute um So I just got back from the neuro from seeing my neurologist, and I can't even remember the last thing I filmed, honestly. But I, ooh, it was a rough few weeks. Let me tell you, I honestly don't know what I said last time. I know it was an update, so I don't know if I mentioned that I went to the emergency room like the worst headache for I don't know like I I couldn't really get out of bed my head was so 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 painful um I was nauseous I just ugh, and I I was like I I really want to film something because I have I've had you know videos planned but obviously I didn't get to any of them because I was just like oh this is so like back from the neurologist and ah I feel so much better I don't know if you can tell but I I do I feel so much better um so they I went to the eye doctor I went to the ophthalmologist and they ruled out papilledema so I don't have a papilledema and um so that really kind of only left um a possible diagnosis of uh, pseudotumor cerebri and that's the one that I was like I don't think I have this I just don't feel like I do I don't know um, even though most of my symptoms were like pretty lined up with um, pseudotumor anyway um, God I just I don't know it's God is good I um, like my headaches they kind of, they pretty much just, like, they were really, really bad for, like, two weeks, and then they stopped, like, I don't know, a week ago, um, and, yeah, I don't really feel dizzy, I don't have, you know, any vision problems anymore, I, like, my vision's kind of blurry sometimes, but it's nothing like it has been, it's, um, it's crazy. It's amazing and I am so thankful to God that it's better. But um they're going to like hold off on testing, like further testing. Um and he wants to see me back in I think 3 months and see how you know how I'm doing. So so I have a bunch of different videos planned. And most of my spooky videos I was going to start doing this month just because I am so excited for spooky stuff. I'm so ready for like scary stuff and Halloween and whew, I'm so ready. Anyway, but I, I think I'm just, I think I'm going to hold off and do all of that in October because it's the spooky month. So anyway, I am doing a tag today and it's a get to know me tag so the first question is what is your middle name so my middle name is Darlene and it's a family name I really like it because it's different um, yeah it almost is like kind of like a southern name I feel like anyway I don't know I don't know if you know if you're not from like the south and your name is Darlene or you know someone let me know cuz like I don't really I've never I've only met one other person with the name Darlene that is not in my family so um, it's my Nana's middle name it's my aunt's middle name what was your favorite subject in high school 
So if we're talking about like traditional like subjects, I would probably say my favorite subject is English just because I love writing, but I also really like history. I loved my history professor. He was absolutely incredible and so, so funny. He was new, so I had him um, my junior and senior year um, for US history and for world history, and he was new. Um, he was really, really young. He was like 26, um, pretty short. I know I'm really short, but he's pretty short. Um, he had like red hair and like a beard. He kind of looked like the brawny towel man, <laughs> paper towel guy. Um, he always wore like wranglers and cowboy boots and like flannel and button downs and stuff like that. Like he had John Wayne posters everywhere. He was like, Oh my gosh, he was so, so funny. There's, there, I have so many stories about him that are literally so, so, so funny because he literally took no crap from anyone and it was great. For saying like true, my favorite class, it was probably yearbook. I was in yearbook for my, I think it was my, sophomore no it was my junior and senior year and it was great I loved taking pictures I loved designing spreads I loved designing stuff um, on like the computer and stuff like that it was so 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 fun and it was a smaller class and like we got to like have like snacks in her mini fridge and just different stuff like that my yearbook teacher was relatively young too she was great it was a great class I really really loved it <clears throat> what is my favorite drink? Um, uh, I really, really like Dr. Pepper. <clears throat> but my favorite drink is probably Cherry Coke. What is your favorite song at the moment? Oh my god. This is always a hard question for me. Because I love music. I do. I love, 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 love music. But at the moment... Oh, I kind of have like three, three or four. I have like four favorite at the moment songs that I'm like rotating and they are, um, The Way I Am by Charlie Puth, um, The Back to You by Selena Gomez, I think it's called I'm the Fire and it's by Hailstorm. And High Hopes by Panic at the Disco. Those are my like favorites at the moment. Have you participated in any sports? Yes, I have. I was in dance for about 10 years, which is really crazy considering all of my medical problems and my OI. But yeah, I was in dance for 10 years. I never broke anything in dance by the grace of God because like I break ribs when I cough and I like break my toe when I'm swimming like crazy stuff like that and I'm like dropping to my knees like on hardwood floors and doing all kinds of weird like back rolls and stuff like that and I I never broke anything I got hella bad bruises though but yes I was in dance and I loved it so much and I sadly had to quit my junior year because my bone pain just got so bad. It was just too hard on my body. What is your favorite book? So this is another kind of hard question because I love books, but because I'm a writer, I am extremely picky about the books that I like. So I tend to lean more towards books that are like my writing style. Um, so I have like, I have like a pretty good like collection of books. It's not like huge, but my favorite books, and I'm pretty sure I've said this more than once on, on my channel are, I say books because it's a series and I can't choose just one, but there are the Elixir books by Hilary Duff. And before you judge, because it's by Hilary Duff, they're so amazing. 
they're they're a pretty easy read but they're really 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 good it's a mystery it's kind of like a love story it's got like some supernatural stuff thrown in there it's oh my gosh it's so good I have read these books so much that I could probably recite them to you and it's elixir is the first one devoted is the second one and true is the third one they're amazing I am pretty much obsessed with them I love them so 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 much and I read them all of the time so those are my favorite books by far <clears throat> what is your favorite color blue which is really crazy because my room is yellow and gray but blue is my favorite color so it's like um, it's like this color like this like aqua blue color it's like aqua Tiffany blue love it love it love it love it love it it is my absolute favorite color so the stuff in my dorm room I'm obviously I'm not on campus this semester because of you know medical reasons it's just it's too hard for me right now so I am so I'm not on campus this semester because it's too hard for me right now medically and just I'm, I'm taking a, a, a break and I did yeah anyway um, but all of my like stuff from my dorm room is like blue it's like that blue color and it's black and those are my favorite colors blue and black are my favorite colors but I also really really like yellow so but blue 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 <laughs> <clears throat> what is your favorite animal So I'm gonna say it's probably a tie of sorts. Um, I love sloths and I love bats and I love squirrels. So those are my favorite animals. <laughs> I love sloths. I love baby sloths. They're so cute. I have a um, little stuffed rainbow sloth that my little sister got me for Valentine's Day. So, so, so cute. Um, and her name is Mikey. Um, comment down below if you're a zombie and you get that reference. <laughs> um, but I also have a little bat, a little Halloween bat, and her name is Salem. Um, I don't have a squirrel yet. I need to get a, like a little stuffed squirrel because I love squirrels. They're so cute. What is your favorite perfume? So, this is my favorite perfume. Um. And I do have an ASMR video planned um, where I go through all my perfumes and tap on them and make all kinds of fun noises. This is my favorite perfume. It is Can Can by Paris Hilton. Most of my perfumes are Paris Hilton perfumes. Um, it's, I really like sweet smelling perfumes. Like I like sweet and kind of fruity. I don't know kind of perfumes. Um, it kind of smells like, where's the thingy? Okay. It kind of smells like candy, but like, I don't know. I wish I could like spray it and you could smell it, but it smells so, so good. I love it. I have two bottles of this. I have this full size bottle that's I'm savoring. And then I have, oh, I have three. I have three. So I have this full size and then I have two smaller ones. So, but that is my favorite perfume. It has been my favorite perfume for a very long time. What is your favorite holiday? Halloween, easy. Have you ever been out of the country? No, I have not, but yes, I, I plan to. I am hoping to be able to go um, spend the summer with my one of my best friends, Abby, who is in my accent tag video um, with me and Abby and Liz. Um, she's British and she lives in Scotland and she's got this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful house that literally looks like something from Pride and Prejudice. Um, so yeah, I really, I, I kind of like, France and Italy and Greece and Romania. I do not know why I want to go to Romania. I cannot give you a great answer. I just do. I feel very drawn to Romania for I don't know why. Um, I mean, I have some friends from Romania from uh, university, but
but I I want to go to Romania. I want to go to Russia. I want to go to Bulgaria. Um, I want to go to the UK. Do you speak any different languages? <sighs> languages are so hard for me. They are so, 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 so hard. Um, I've tried to learn French. I have tried very hard to learn French. I wanted to learn it so bad, could not do it. I can say very, 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 very small increments of French. So I mean like, je suis Shelby, so like my name is Shelby, uh, je suis fatigué, like I'm tired, it's the, like things like that. <clears throat> I do speak a little bit of Cherokee, so my Native American, um, I just forgot. So, like, um, I'm trying to think of something to say. My native name, my Native American name is Gohineg, which means happy in Cherokee. Um, I know, like, a bunch of random words in Cherokee. So, like, Cheliki is Cherokee. Yon is bear. Um, Hesti is quit or stop. Um, Gistej is mouse. So, like, different things like that. Um, Osio is, ha is hello. Or seal is what my family say. Like, what's up? Hi. Wado is thank you. Um, but I do know sign language. I do know a decent amount of sign language. Um, I took ASL, and I I really really loved I, I loved ASL. It was so much fun. I really loved the class. I love the language because I talk with my hands a lot. And I don't know. I really I loved sign language. So I do speak some sign. I do speak sign language. Um, I wouldn't say I'm fluent in sign language. Um, I can get through a conversation if you go very, try to show my hands, if you go very slowly. Um, and I also do not do ASL, I do pigeon sign. So for those of you that don't know, um, brief ASL lesson. Um, ASL, so American Sign Language, is very much like the way French is, which is why French was so hard for me, is because everything is like backwards almost. So it's like the most important um, word first and then everything kind of follows suit. And that's just so hard for my brain to like grasp. Um, so it would be like, name yours what? Um, like that and I just ugh, it's so hard for my brain to like grasp that so I do pigeon sign which is um, like English word order but with ASL signs so instead of like name yours what it would be like what's your name like that so it makes more sense to me um, but I do really wish that I could learn other languages. I want to know French. I want to know Italian. I want to know Russian. There are so many languages that I would love to learn, but I cannot do it. I've tried so very hard. Do you have any siblings? Yes, I do. I have three siblings. Three. This is three in sign language. So I have three siblings. I am the oldest. My youngest sister is the one that lives with me. Um, all of my siblings are half, but they're all my siblings nonetheless. So my youngest sister, Alana, is who lives with me. She is eight. My two other siblings that I wish I were closer with, I'm pretty close with my brother, but um, my two other siblings do not live with me. My next um, youngest sibling is my other sister, Cadence, and she is, I'm a terrible sister. Um, I believe that she's 14. And then my brother is um, a freshman in college, which makes me feel so old. So yeah, but I am the oldest sibling. What is your favorite store? <sighs> so um, like right up the top of my head, I'm gonna go with Sephora. Um, I love Sephora, love, love, love Sephora. But I also really like Bath and Body Works, and it's a clothing store called Garage, 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 like a garage store. It's um, very grungy type of clothes, which I really, really like. 
so those are my favorite stores. What is your favorite restaurant? So I don't I don't really like to eat, which I know it sounds really, really stupid, but I've always said that. I really just, I don't love eating. Like, I don't like Thanksgiving just because it's like mostly about, you know, eating a lot. And I just, I don't like to eat a lot. I just don't, I don't know. But my favorite restaurant. Okay, so my favorite restaurant is, I don't know the name of it. But it is a pretty small pizza place, um, and it's a pizzeria in low. I think it's in Lower Manhattan. It's in New York. Um, it's by like it's by NYU and like Washington Square Park. It's a little bit down that way. If you know where I'm talking about, it is really really good. The pizza is really 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 good. Um, that is my favorite restaurant. I don't know the name of it. I wish I did. Um, do you like school? So, um, I'm a college student and I'm a psych major. So, no. <laughs> no. I don't dislike school. I love campus. I like, I love campus life. I miss it so very much. I miss seeing my friends all the time. I miss living in the dorms because my dorm room was actually really nice. Um, but I don't really miss like classes and stuff like that. So I like, I like, I like, I like school because I love learning about psychology and my degree and all of that and, you know, working towards my master's and, you know, all of that, my PSYD, all of that stuff. But at the same time, it's very stressful. It's very, very hard. N not an easy major. Anyway, so I, I, I would say I, I, I like school pretty okay, but it, it does kind of kill me sometimes. <laughs> Who are some of your favorite YouTubers? Okay. My very first, my favorite, favorite YouTuber is Mikey from Glam and Gore. Love, love, love Mikey so very much. I am a very dedicated zombie. I have a Glam and Gore sweatshirt. Um, I everything I know about SFX I learned from her. She's the reason that I do SFX as like a hobby. Um, I love Mikey. So Mikey is one of my favorites. I also really like Mickey. So Mikey, and then there's Mickey from Life with Stripes. She is a, another zebra, not the same type of zebra I am. She has EDS and um, POTS and gastroparesis. And I really, really like Loey Lane. So love her. She's a paranormal type of YouTuber. And Haley, um, <clears throat> Haley Reese, I really like her too. She's great. She's so sweet and I wish I could meet her. Um, and I don't really know if this would count, but I love BuzzFeed Unsolved very, 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 very much. I have a BuzzFeed Unsolved shirt that I wear a lot. It says, I don't know, spooky stuff. So, and I am a Bugara. So, if you're a Bugara, let me know. Or if you're a Shaniac. Uh, those are my favorite YouTubers. What is your favorite movie? Okay, I have three favorite movies. They are The Age of Adeline with Blake Lively, because I love Blake Lively so, so very much. I want to see her new movie so bad. Like, so bad. I've wanted to see it before it was even, like, a big, like, before there was, like, trailers for it everywhere. I found the trailer by accident, and I was like, oh my god, I need to see this. And, yes, I have to see it. So The Age of Adeline, Breakfast at Tiffany's with Audrey Hepburn, who I also love, and The Breakfast Club. Club. Those are my favorite movies. What are some of your favorite TV shows? So, um, Supernatural. Supernatural. Love, love, love Supernatural. It's almost un unhealthy how much I love Supernatural. Dina's my favorite. Dina and Jack. I love them both so very, very, very much. Um... Gossip Girl, 
love Gossip Girl. Um, uh, Pretty, Little Liar Pretty Little Liars, I liked until the end when they kind of screwed everything up. Um, I Zombie is really, really great too. And Criminal Minds, so I love all of those. Stay tuned for all of the spookiness. Um, also, I have recently um, joined Reddit, so yeah. Um, might start reading some creepy Reddit stories because there's a bunch. Um, but yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, leave a comment down below if you have any questions. Let me know if you subscribe to any of the fandoms, I think that's what they're called, that I've listed. So like the Zombies or the Reese's Pieces or I don't know what Lois are called. Or if you love Supernatural or any of that stuff, let me don't know down in the comments below. And also let me know who your favorite YouTubers are. Um, thank you guys so very much for watching. I love you all so very much and I will try to post um, some more videos this week. Granted, this great feeling doesn't go away. Love you guys so much. Please leave a like and subscribe to my channel.